This beats Gorbachev. How about that? Everybody, how sweet it is always to come home and to be here for the greatest tree lighting in the world and the greatest city in the world and the most beautiful democracy in the world on the greatest planet in the entire universe. Did I miss anybody? We have one little technical problem. Anybody in the crowd have an extension cord? We're about a little short over here for about five feet. If you could help us out, we would appreciate it before the show is over. We wish you all good times, and there's going to be a great lighting here in a few minutes. And we want to thank Lieutenant Commander James M. Bankhead. Let's hear it for the United States Air Force, the greatest team that ever flew. And while we are thanking, let us also thank the... Performers, especially our friends, the Bears, Teddy Bear, Petty Bear, for coming all the way from Bear Bank to dance for us again. And how about the California Raisins? Sensational. The 1987 pageant. You heard them a few minutes ago. One of the outstanding... of St. Benedict at Collegeville, Minnesota. As musical ambassadors from the great state of Minnesota, they bring to the pageant their incredible talent and virtuosity under the direction of Mr. Axel Timer. Will you please welcome once again the men and women of the St. John's University College of St. Benedict Chamber Choir. Here they are.
Alex Timer, thank you so much, and thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Please stay on stage. But when Christ was born, born
United States and Mrs. Reagan. My fellow citizens, the 1987 pageant of peace has a special significance this year. The lighting of the national Christmas tree with its star of peace atop could not come at a more symbolic moment. Two hours ago, General Secretary Gorbachev's plane touched down on American soil. I invited him to come and discuss ways in which we can reduce the tensions between our two countries. He and I will meet in hopes of promoting peace for our peoples and all the people of the earth. I hope the General Secretary is watching this on TV. I'd like him to see what we're celebrating because for us, Christmas celebrates the cause of peace on earth, goodwill toward men. Peace on earth, goodwill toward men. I cannot think of a better spirit in which to begin the meetings of the next several days. As a small reminder of that spirit, a star of peace atop the national Christmas tree will be lit day and night during the time our Soviet guests are here. And as we look out from the White House during our discussions, let the star remind us why we've gathered and what we seek. In Luke chapter 10, verse 5, we read, Peace be to this house. That blessing is most appropriate over the next several days. And with that said, Tommy Valenti, we'll light the national Christmas tree and let the star of peace shine for all of us. sweet. How beautiful. What a lovely sight. And now Cheryl Mills, Patty Austin, and the choir and the United States Air Force Band will sing and play, O Come All Ye Faithful. paid let's sing out let's go
Christmas once again, and thank you all. And so ends the 1987 Christmas Pageant of Peace and our ceremonies. The pageant continues. Enjoy all the territorial trees and the state trees. Find your tree and check the beautiful one in the center. That, of course, our national tree. And let's give another round of applause for our marvelous...